have released this new footies hero canoe card as an SBC. And he was very good value for money. An 86 rated squad for this card. And it looks very intriguing. Especially looking at that 97 dribbling. But we'll look at the stats in a second. But let's now take a closer look at the card. High medium work rates. 4 star, 5 star. Looking saucy for a striker. Especially someone who's six foot five. No real shock on positions, centre forward striker. Looking at these playstyle pluses, I've got to say, the first thing I'm noticing is this rapid playstyle plus. Considering he's six foot five and how long his strides are going to be, giving him a pace based playstyle plus feels like it might make him very OP in game. He's got power shot plus for those that like using power shots, chip shot plus. I mean, not necessarily the most overpowered and not really a playstyle that gets used very often, I would say. And then he's got the aerial plus as well. Looking at these in-game stats, though, um, looking at that 97 dribbling, obviously I was expecting the agility and balance to actually be a lot higher than that. Because when you see a 97, you're then expecting every stat within that to be near or around that or to try and add up to an average of 97 but that does not look like that would average to 97 but ea has an algorithm of how it calculates that 95 pace but then he's only got the 89 acceleration but you could stick a um i'm thinking maybe an engine maybe not necessarily going for a shadow hunter catalyst or something to really maximize that pace because i'm looking at dribbling and maybe wanting to maybe add a little bit more to the agility and balance and an engine would make sense to that but obviously overall these stats are looking very very good for a striker card here is the team yes it's not the best looking team especially for right now in footies but i only created the, the team about two weeks ago uh, as a part of an rtg to do between now and the end of fc 24 let's see how good this card is come on then nicely done using that rapid that was a comfortable goal i thought i heard that courtois meant to be good and he didn't even remotely look close to saving that again there you go I I feel giving him rapid plus has just made him a little bit OP. Even just for that initial one-two step. The, just the ability to take one or two strides with that. With a guy of that height. It does make such a big difference. See, yet again. <laughs> he's, he's turning very well. I didn't actually put an engine on him in the end. But... I'm having no issues with the way he turns. Hat trick from three shots in game number one. I will go into another game to try him out a little bit more. Oh, we've conceded a corner. I, I would have thought... Oh, yeah, there he is. I was going to say, where is my six foot five giant in the team? Although, I would say, why is he not running up to counter-attack from this corner? Instead, Jesus is doing it for me. You're not even inside the box, Canoe, there. Jesus has done all the work there. Okay, come on. Make the run. Use that rapid. Get some pace between you and the defenders. He's got Roberto Carlos on him. Turned nicely there. Get a pass off, but we don't get a shot and an assist for him. Oh, lovely through ball. Come on. Jesus, there we go. Oh, no! Oh, he's missed. Oh, God. Jesus, you fraud. One, two. You see, lovely through ball again from Canoe. Although, would like the AI to actually make him do a run. And he's just missed. That's two, what? Probably like easy opportunities to get a goal. And both of my strikers have let me down a little bit there. Again, nice little pass. And we're pretty much through. Take my time. No, Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. What are you doing, pal? 
Good. Nice. Now, this is where I want you to finish this, Knut. No! Good save by Cordwell. Get a rebound goal. I didn't know whether to try and do a finesse or go around the goalkeeper. I just wanted to go straight for the goal route. Simple part shot there. Another lovely pass over the top. Claw one goal back and get an assist for him as well there. Lovely run. Lovely pass. Come on then. Can you get another goal? Okay. We're losing 6-5. It's 81st minute. There is a chance I could at least make a draw in this Div Rivals game. But he's doing good job right now. Oh, I feel so unlucky. Because this guy's got a good team. And I think it's his team that's carrying him to the victory. But we've, we've done well. Canoe's got some goals. We might be able to get one more goal with him, potentially. Let's see. Yeah, there you go. Move your player out of the way. Oh, it was off the post. See, he just, tur he just turns so well. And the amount of goals that he's got in these two games, he does not feel like he is six foot five. He is turning like somebody who is small and agile. Just the two goals and one assist in that game, but it does take his tally to five goals, one assist across the two games. So let's talk about the card itself. Feels absolutely fantastic in game. Like. As I said a few times, like, the card turns so well, he doesn't feel like I'm using a 6'5 player. Like, in comparison to other 6' and taller players that I've used in the game, I'm thinking maybe, like, a CR7, for instance, and his Path to Glory. That Path to Glory card does not turn as well as this Canoe card does. Like, this card had something special uh, that it felt like in-game. The fact that when it had its back towards goal and you wanted to turn around and get shot off, did it perfectly, smoothly, calmly, coolly. The passing as well. Oh my god. Chef's kiss. The passing was on point with getting Jesus um, through on goal a couple of times. But it is a nice, fun card and it is dirk cheap for an 86 rated squad but i think i'm gonna leave the review at that thank you for watching if you do go out and do this canoe spc card let me know what you think in the comment section of it and whether you're gonna continue using it whether you enjoyed it or not but that is gonna be it thank you for watching and i'll catch you all in the next video Bye bye guys